Hello, everybody. Welcome to Wet Honey Hospital Podcast. In today's episode, we are going to discuss about the importance of breast cancer screening. We are here with Dr. Tanet Des s a k t i p o n an oncologist at Wet Honey Hospital. Hello, doctor. Thank you for joining our today podcast. We appreciate it very much. Hello. Thank you for inviting me to join too. Okay, as everyone knows, breast cancer is one of the most common cancer in women. So I believe every woman are afraid of getting breast cancer. So, doctor, may I know what causes breast cancer? Sure, cause of breast cancer we are unknown, but the risk factor of breast cancer include aging, obesity, long-term taking hormonal replacement, and also a family history of breast cancer and genetic disease. Okay, doctor, I wonder, is it true that women with big breasts are at higher risk? Of getting breast cancer than women with small breasts. It is debatable, but women with big breasts may have the potential to miss the diagnosis when screening, because of breast size larger than the p l a c e or mammogram machine. Uh-huh. However, healthcare provider will check the underside breasts combined with mammogram to reduce the missed diagnosis p l a c e Oh, alright, doctor, can you please tell us the ways of how to prevent breast cancer? Yes, certainly. Two points to remember for prevention breast cancer are: first, is reducing risk by control your weight, avoid unnecessary hormonal replacement, mm-hmm. and second, monthly cells breast examination and annually screening mammogram start at age at 40 years old, because in study, women who have screening mammograms have a lower chance of dying from breast cancer. That women who do not have skinny mammograms. Oh, I see. May I know how does mammogram work? Okay, mammogram is an X-ray picture of your breast. Procedure: A technician will take the patient based on a plastic plate, and another plate will firmly place your breast from above. Mm-hmm. The plate will flatten the breast, holding it still while the X-ray is being taken the picture. Mm. So, can women with breast implants undergo mammograms? Yes, they can. But people with breast implant should inform the technician before doing mammogram. Patient with breast implant should be screened for breast cancer by mammogram with ultrasound of the breast. Oh, so when is the best time for a mammogram? The best time for mammogram is seven days after patient period. Doctor, in case that a tumor was found during the breast cancer scanning, what are you going to do for the next step? Okay, if the result is abnormal, first, an abnormal mammogram does not always means that there are cancers. So you will need to have an additional test, called needle biopsy of a tumor, to diagnosis is recommended. Oh, I see. All right. Thank you, doctor, for taking your time from your busy schedule to talk with us today. You're welcome. Okay, guy. Breast cancer is a dangerous disease, but it can be cured by early detection. So, if you are a woman aged over 40 years old, you should have breast cancer screening with mammography once a year because early detection saves life. Please don't forget to follow us on Spotify and subscribe to our YouTube channel to get a notification. When we upload the new healthcare tips for you, see you in the next episode. สวัสดีค่ะ See you. สวัสดีครับ